Hey there, welcome back to our channel. I'm back with a new video. Today I'll be showing you how can you remotely control Android phone from another Android device. If you want to remotely control Android from another Android device, then you just need to make sure to watch this video right till the end. Now first of all, what you want to do is make sure to open up your Play Stores. Since you need to use a specific application, so go to your respective uh, Play Store. And on the search box, you want to type in Android file and remote access. Once you do it, so click the install button and wait for it to completely install it. So and make sure to get on. I agree and all that. So once you've actually bypassed all of these steps, then what you have to do is you just have to simply go ahead and create your account or sign in to your account. Once the application is completely installed, you want to click the open button. Now here, you want to go ahead and make sure to click on the sign up button. So after you've actually done it so you want to go ahead and select a google account or you could actually go with the email address as well i'm just going to simply use the google account once i've actually done it so what next you have to do is you want to go ahead and create the email address or enter in the email address so once done you need to go ahead and enter in the verification code that has been sent so here i'm just going to swipe down and then uh, receive the verification code here it is so you could just long press onto it and click on the copy button after which you could exit out of this page and then paste it right over here and click on verify and sign up so once done you want to click on the save button and then click on continue after which you want to make sure to allow this and all of that and exit out of this page and click on allow and you want to click on the ok button here what you want to do is you want to make sure to toggle the button for all of these now what next you need to do is you need to do the same procedure to the other device where you want remote control and then once you've actually set up your account you could see the particular devices information on the uh, on the page make sure that you're using the same account and once you've actually done this so you could go ahead and click on i have the activate uh, activation code you could go ahead and type in there and that way you should be able to use it so or that is how you could remotely control android from another android that's the way you could do it so i hope the video was helpful make sure to like share and subscribe to our channel thank you for watching see you in the next video